Hey yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the Man 70 video. So today we are inside Gun Snugs at the Jets playbook. This is also in the Broncos playbook. If you guys are interested, I want to play with the Jets because people are saying, oh, you're playing with the Cowboys running a run play, and that's why it's doing so good. Well, I could run that play just as effectively in the uh, Seahawks playbook with uh, no offensive line at all. I could run it as effectively in the Jets playbook. But you know, enough of that. I'm showing you guys these players are legit. These players are awesome. These players are only the best players for y'all. So, like I said, Jets playbook, Broncos playbook, Gun Snugs. Uh, so let's hop right in here. Uh, this is the old roster. I got B Marsh on the Steam Eric Decker too, but it's still gonna work just as well. So the play is called Jet Slot Post. Now, um, no really adjustments yet. I would just have like your normal receiver. It doesn't really matter who you put out there. It does not matter at all. Like it, it really doesn't matter who you who you put out there. So yeah, we're gonna run a basic Tampa two here, guys. All right, so Tampa two. Now what I like to do here. Uh, there's one setup if they're running a Tampa 2 uh, You put Eric Decker on a streak or, or you could put B Marsh on a streak and uh, forward turn an out route because um, well, I'll, just, I'll, just, I'll just show you I'll just show you why this works so well. So pass lead outside one play touchdown most of the time All right, most of the time Robbie Anderson will get open anyway. Like you just put Robbie Anderson out there uh, He will just get open um, without you know anyone's help because he's just that tall big guy but you want to have that streak going up there uh to just uh, make sure you know it, it'll work way better uh, i would maybe put robbie anderson there where b marsh is because he has a little bit more speed to stretch the field a little bit better but uh, you don't need it as you can tell he caught it both times for a good 30 40 yards was it it was a lot of yards huge huge gains uh let's run it one more time to anonymous side just because we want that boy to get out there as you can tell we can hit our boy matt forte underneath uh we can hit him right there and he's gonna get uh 13 yards so that's glitchy right there. Put Forte on a uh, curl route too. Uh, as you guys know, curl routes are glitchy in the pass game right there. Boom. Uh, on a cover two, I really wouldn't look for that. But if it is man coverage, I mean, that's why you have Forte on the out route here because the out route is going to be really, really nice. Uh, this is just like a basic way to set it up, guys. The main way, I like to set it up. So right here, what I like to do here, put Decker on a streak. A Nunwa on a uh, slant route. Anderson on an in route. And we put up, uh, we just block Forte, and I put Forte over here, just so I have a little bit more blocking, uh, because I want to hit that post route over in the middle uh, where B Marsh is. So you're gonna see Matt Forte blocks better than uh, Ryan Clady, so it's actually better to have him out there, right there. Boom! All you want to do is hit B Marsh over top. As you can tell, B Marsh is just gonna. Wow. Okay. I, I thought I was trying to truck uh, Tremont Williams, which uh, you know would happen anyway, because Tremont's a small, small guy. He's a corner man at safety now. But uh, gonna run it one more time. Yeah, I'm gonna show you guys these underneath routes here. So, uh, put Forte out there. Uh, if you guys do hear my fan, uh, it's not my fault. You, I have to, uh, you know, it has to be on, man. It's too hot in here. But, hey, let's hit these underneath routes here. Uh, we're just going to hit our boy, uh, who's this, Robbie Anderson underneath. Boom, right there. Uh, if you guys wouldn't mind dropping a like right now, subscribing to the channel, too. That would be nice because uh, just a little bit of payment for me getting these uh, these videos out to you guys, these plays out to y'all. So, if y'all could do that real quick, that would be really nice. Be much appreciated. But let's keep running here. So, Forte's out there. All right, boom. He's going to block for us. And uh, right there, as you can tell, Brandon Marshall's going to get wide open. And I want to chuck Jamal Williams this time. Boom. Get down. Get down. He's too small, bro. B. Marsh is like a tight end receiver. He's the most physical guy you've ever seen, man. You always have to contact. He's a beast, man. But yeah, let's keep running in here. Motion Forte over here. As you can tell, he gets that block over there. Sometimes it won't work because For Forte, I think, is a pretty good pass block. I'm not really sure. I don't know how he is in real life pass blocking, but this game, he's he's killing in the pass block. We're trying to spin. Oh, get right. Wow, he just got wild. Wow. Come on, you should not be playing safety, bro. You should not be playing safety. Uh, let's run it one more time. Yeah, let's run it one more time. So, Decker on a streak, Anunua on a uh, slant route, and uh, Forte. You don't really even need, need to do it. You can just block him normally, but this works better, in my opinion. So, right there, boom. He's going to block. He's going to be on, uh, was that like, I don't know, even know who that, that's Jamie Collins, I'm pretty sure. But, hey, get in the end zone, B-Marsh. Get in the end zone. Let's stiff arm him. Oh, he got wrecked, bro. Hey, let's move on to cover three, guys. All right, guys, cover three, Sky, now. Right here, just put him on a slant. You know, put him on a in route. Same exact setup as last time. Uh, block B Marsh here, as you guys know. I mean, not B Marsh. Uh, Forte. Oh, you can put Forte over there too if you want. This is, they're sending a nasty blitz from the right side. Hey, put him there too. It doesn't really matter what you want to do with him. But yeah, it's running right here. Yeah, they're they're up blitzing from that side. So right here, as you can tell, hit your boy underneath right here. Uh, Robbie Anderson. Only gonna get two yards there, but I don't know. I don't really know what happened there. But um, your made read is of course gonna be your boy up top, Mr. Um, Brandon Marshall. So let's motion down Forte one more time. All right, Matt Forte, block for me, baby. All right. Right here. You can also hit uh what's his face there? 
That was a horrible throw. I don't know what I was thinking, guys. That was an absolute horrible throw. Anon was like your uh, user. He'll take away your user out, but uh, most of the time he will not work out too well. So it's motion out Forte over here. Let's go up top to just our normal, you know, our normal route we're supposed to hit most of the time. As you can tell right there, boom. Gonna get wide open B Marsh. Gonna get rid of, I think that's Body Calhoun or uh, I don't know who it was. That's Jamar Taylor, actually, I'm pretty sure. Uh, deck over there. All your normal adjustments. Forte over here. As you can tell, this play works absolutely amazing, guys. I would not give you guys plays that did not work. And as you can tell, this play is working absolutely amazingly as he's getting double teamed there and right there. Boom. Easy as that. If um, it seems a little, if the ball's thrown kind of weird, I would definitely aggressive catch it. I'm surprised Bryce Petty is throwing DOS out here, but hey, I'm not complaining, bro. I'm not complaining, Bryce. Keep keep keep, keep doing what you're doing, bud. Keep doing what you're doing. You're killing it. But yeah, like I said, aggressive catch it if things seem a little off, you know, right there. Boom. I would aggressive catch it pretty much every single time, and I would possession catch it if the ball a third look like they're gonna knock the ball out. But let's run it a couple more times and let's move on to man coverage. Sorry, motion forte. Right here, boom. Snap the ball. As you can tell, they're getting double teamed there. And right up top, right there, boom. Uh, you, you put uh, Anonymous on a slant and um, Robbie Anderson on a uh, in route because those routes are going to take away the user, most likely. Because the, the user doesn't really use your user the safety over top. They're usually going to use the, uh, the linebackers uh, in the middle of the field. So, hey, right there, boom. Robbie Anderson going to get wide open. He's got more speed than, uh, you know, Cam Johnson there, who's really, really slow. But, hey, guys, let's move on to uh, cover two, man. Alright guys, like I always do, always run cover two man out of quarters because some people don't believe me that it works. Alright now, B Marsh, his route's not really going to destroy man too well. I, It's not really a route that's going to beat man that well at all. But uh, it still can, just not the route I would look for here. On Forte, I mean if they're running like quarters, I would just probably run the ball. But um, I'd probably put him on like an out route or something like this. I don't know. But right here, if he's blocking here, if you motion him out here, I would just block him. If he's in the backfield still, then I would uh, definitely just uh, put him on an out route or something to just beat man coverage. But as you can tell, they're getting double teamed there. And uh, B Marsh is open. But, uh, you know, I, I just I took the knee throw. You could have hit B Marsh. Um, still can get wide open there. But uh, we're not even going to put Matt Forte down there just because that's a waste of time. But uh, let's do this up here. Try to hit B Marsh here. His uh, post route is really not a it's, a. it's a weird post route. Like it doesn't really. It, he kind of like rounds off the uh, route there, which is kind of weird. I don't know why he does that. Like I've seen corner routes like that too, but I, I don't know what he's smoking. But hey, Matt Forte over here. Uh, just put him on an out route like I said before. You can put him on an out route right there. Matt Forte, one of the best route routers in the league at running back. So right there, boom. Nice. Okay, Ro okay. Quincy Nuno doesn't know how to block apparently, but hey, uh, we're gonna get open there. Let's run a couple more times here for you guys. Uh, let's just try to hit. Uh, we, did, we didn't put Forte on the drop, but it doesn't matter. Right there, boom. I just tell Quincy Nuno. Right there, boom. Jump over him. Easy as that. All right. So let's keep running here. Anderson there. Eric Deck on a streak. Block Forte. Put him out here. Put him on the right side. Like I said, they're setting a nasty, nasty blitz off the uh, right side. So Ryan Clady and Matt Forte. Ryan Clady is the worst blocker in this in this uh, situation. But now right there, as you guys can tell, Robbie Anderson is gonna get upfield for a gain of uh, 28 yards, I'd say. But yeah, guys, if you did enjoy the video, make sure you guys leave a like. It is appreciated. Uh, it really is appreciated, guys. Helped out the channel a lot. Uh, make sure you all hop in my live streams. Uh, I'm I'm streaming a lot less now because my internet just really it's just really not fun. I I have pretty bad internet to stream off of. Kind of sucks, but I, I try to work with what I got. But yeah, guys, like I said, leave a like if y'all did enjoy. Subscribe if you guys are new. 550 subscribers strong. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.